Okay. Hi. I can't even think of a proper intro right now. I'm just... This is what I have been waiting for. For a very long time. And... It released this morning at 4 a.m. I was asleep. I had class today. All day. Uh... I just got home a little while ago and I rushed over here so I could finally see this and you know finally finally watch this long awaited comeback by Red Velvet who are my favorite K-pop group and I'm so excited and I'm just going to start I brought out the good the good headphones for this just for this occasion <laughs> Okay, okay. I've tried to avoid spoilers all day. Okay, okay. Let's do this. <laughs> oh. Are you ready for this? <laughs> They look so good. <laughs> oh my god! Yareen opening the song? Oh my god. Holy shit, the production quality. Sugi. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Is this the whole close? Oh. oh, okay. Okay, here's the teaser. Na, 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 na. Na, 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 na. Oh! <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. I can't even process. <gasps> oh my god, Sugi! <laughs> oh my god! Yo! Holy shit, a dance club breakdown? Ah! I'm smiling so hard. Oh my god! Yes, Queen! What? Oh, vocals. <laughs> Wendy. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> you can't see my face, but my eyes are tearing right now. I'm just I'm so freaking happy. <sighs> We waited like seven months for this and it was I think it was worth it. I oh my god, I need to rewatch this like twenty thousand times. And it, <laughs>
there was so much going on with the vocals and everybody looked so good and I got distracted with how they looked. I couldn't really pay attention to the music that was going on, but like some of it kind of, oh my God, some of it kind of matched what I said in my CLC uh, reaction review, whatever the hell, uh, like the song is like really explosive in your face and then the bridge it just takes it way down thank you uh what uh, what are their names david and louis the swedish duo you guys are brilliant oh wow people i know people were saying that this is like their i got a boy uh girls generation i think i mean it's not too far off <laughs> Oh, it's like, okay, there's a lot of K-pop songs that try to do this. They put a bunch of different, a bunch of different pieces together that sound completely different and make it into one song. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Girls' Generation is like the prime example of that, that pulled it off like awesome. It's legendary. In my, sorry, I burped right there. In my opinion, someone that tried to do that and it didn't work too well was uh, Blackpink's Kill This Love. Like, it, it, the pieces didn't really flow that well to me. But um, this one, I need to go back and hear it again to really analyzes the flow and stuff and like oh my god <laughs> i'm just so happy to hear their voices again <laughs> i don't even understand i'm not crying i'm just like oh my god i'm just disbelief in a good way and speechless kind of in a good way <sighs> i just took a test in my class and it's like this was my reward <laughs> Ah, reward indeed. Okay, I need to watch this again. Oh my god. <laughs> the choreo, I wasn't even really- Oh my god, I read. Are you ready for this? Someone said that- <laughs> Someone said that that was like- <laughs> When a sim, like, meets someone for the first time. <laughs> it's, oh, it's pretty accurate. Oh, that's so funny. <laughs> Are you ready for this? <laughs> okay. Yes. Oh, my God. Oh, the, did she wink? Hold on. Yeah! <laughs> I can't even go like two seconds. They're all so pretty. Holy shit! Oh my god! What the fuck? It's not, it's not even fair. Oh my god, Irene. This is the first verse. Ooh, that was a abrupt jump. Okay. But like, like it flowed because the beat was still going on. The drums, I mean. Seamless. Okay. <laughs> Hold on. Is Irene like in the in the back like freaking Santa Claus? Oh, it's Yuri. <laughs> Oh my god, Sugi! She's fit as f. Oh my god! Woohoo! Ooh, and two teeth. Okay, hold on, hold on, wait, wait, wait. It still flows. Okay. Yeah, because the vocals, it still flows because the vocals start before the other one finishes. 
Yeah. And then it changes back to, I think this was the intro. But I mean, it, it works because it doesn't stop and then just start again. And that's kind of what I feel like uh, Kill This Love did. Like it was stop completely and then start another segment. And that made it feel like disjointed. It, the flow felt weird. But this one, it it's like, it's working. And I don't think I'm just saying that because I'm biased. Like I'm trying to like pick it apart a, a little bit. <laughs> okay, well, Wendy's so pretty and hair suits her so well. <laughs> Irene getting them lines? Hey girls! Oh, I just realized it has subtitles. Yo, SM! SM, they actually cared this time. They're- wow! I don't even think any other one any of the other ones got subtitles as fast. Oh my god. They really believed in this one, huh? Well, I guess if Lee Suman says it's time, you gotta put <laughs> everything into it. Oh my god. <laughs> I saw Twitter. I saw Twitter having a meltdown over that part. Oh my god, now I understand completely why. I get it. I get it completely. <laughs> Ooh, harmonies. Holy shit, I didn't even realize that the first time. Whoa, 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 joy. <laughs> She's so good at that move. I think that's like her move. That one right there. Oh my god. I'm sorry I keep rewinding this. I just... Oh my god. It's a lot to take in. Oh! Hold on, hold on. Sorry. I'm just trying to catch the transitions. It still worked. It had a drum fill. Yeah. Oh my god, I don't have anything bad to say about this. I mean, maybe that's just my my bias showing, but like I really don't. The flow still worked. It had the beat going on. Even though they were completely different sounding sections throughout the whole thing. I just I need <laughs> This is so worth it today. I needed this. I've been so stressed. I had three tests in, in these past three days. Oh my god, thank you, Red Velvet, for relieving some stress, bringing some joy, your visuals, your vocals, everything, your dancing. I'm sure once I've listened to it like 10, 20 more times, I'll find something, not bad, but just something that I wish could have been this way or that way or whatever. But I have, like, no criticism right now. I'm just, I'm in awe. I'm in shock in a good way. I think my voice is shaking a little bit. Oh, my God. Thank you, Red Velvet. Oh, okay. It has... The other thing that helps it flow is that it keeps the bass going. It doesn't change the bass from these two parts. That's another thing that really helps the flow, even though they com they sound completely different. The bass doesn't change much either here. It's keeping that steady flow. Back to the same from the beginning. Steady bass still. The bass is a little bit different, but it's not that. It doesn't stray too far. And this part, too. It's the only thing that's really changing are the drums. This is back to the beginning. But it feels different because the drums are different, too, from the part in the beginning. Oh, this part's so good. 
This makes me want to get up and dance. <sighs> so good. I think my least favorite part is yeah, the the dance breakdown. I think this is my least favorite part. It's not bad, it's just um not my favorite. So the first half of the harmony sounds like windy and soggy. When Joy singing the Joy sings the main line first and then it's windy and it's soggy doing the harmonies and then Sugi takes the main line. And you can hear Joy clearly and Yuri and Irene. Actually, the first time I heard Yuri really clearly in the first half of the harmonies. This time I didn't hear it. Something like that, though. But they switch off and it's awesome. I really hope that Wendy's able to pull that off awesomely live. Because I know in, uh, in RBV she had some struggles doing those high notes but it there's not too much going on here as far as like notes all over the place like rbb did that was a lot of notes this one there's not that many which i it's good for her it'll be not easier but easier to tackle i guess Maybe like six notes versus like, I don't know, like 12 or something. Nice, nice. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, I don't want to make this too long. Also, I wanted to say that this song, I well, the whole EP, the Re Festival Day One, it made uh, number one on the US uh, iTunes chart. And. They're the first K-pop girl group to do that. So, congratulations, Red Velvet. You deserved it. I bought the album twice on iTunes. And I also got the bundle with the guidebook. I know. I know. I'm a stan. I'm not ashamed to admit it. But, um, I thought that was really awesome. They're breaking their own records. They broke their own records with this comeback with the first day sales over 45,000. I think they're number three in first day sales of girl groups now. I was just so proud of them. So, so, so proud. And the, f oh, it's seven million views. It looks like they're going to break the RVV 24 hour views on YouTube too. RVV had like 7.3 million, I think. Right now they're at a little over 7 million and it hasn't been the 24 hours yet I think it, it needs like um actually there's still a good amount of time left oh my god I think this is going to be a turning point for them especially now that we know that it's going to there's going to be a day 2 and a finale of this festival era I'm really excited to see what they do in the future Oh my god. Now that I've calmed down a little bit, I've digested it. It's still amazing. I know I said I had a least favorite part, but I'm sure once I listen to this five more times, that's going to change. Actually, I, I guarantee that. <laughs> oh, I'm so proud of them. Red Velvet, Red Velvet. Irreplaceable, irreplaceable girl group indeed. Okay, I don't want to make this an hour long, so I guess that's all I will say for this reaction, review, whatever. Okay, until next time, lates.